Well, like I said earlier, my name is Angela, and it is my honor to be here tonight. Um, I'm going to sing a song for you all, and this song means quite a bit to me. Um, so, I love writing, and I love writing words, and I love writing stories, uh, and I love co-writing songs, but don't have the ability to write a song by myself because I don't know how to play the piano, I don't know how to play the guitar. Um, that's a really cool thing to be able to know how to do. Uh, but one day, I, my good buddy and I, we were writing something for Mariner's Kids, and there was music, and we were almost done. And we got to a point where we had, I think, two songs left to write. And something happened in his life where it's family emergency, and you can't say, well, keep doing this thing that you're volunteering right now. I need you to help me finish this song, right? That's not the right answer. The right answer is, go be with your family, right? And so I said that and went, okay, God. It's you and me now. <laughs> We're alone. I don't know what to do. <laughs> and I felt like God said in that moment, uh, go to scripture. Uh, it's kind of like, well, yeah. That's a great idea. I should have thought of that on my own. <laughs> um, and so I did, and I, and I opened up scripture, and the story we were writing was all about the parables in the Bible. We created a musical called... Uh, it was basically, it was called the Big Picture Show the Musical, if you, were, if you were a part of the Big Picture Show when that was a thing here. Anyways, that's beside the point. So, I opened up the scripture, and we're at the end, and this is literally the last song of the, of the show, and, and I said, all right. So I just read, and I read about Jesus and the parables, and this idea of faith of a mustard seed just kept popping out. And quite literally in that moment, I said, that's about all I've got right now. I mean, I've got faith in you, God. But you're asking me to do something right now that I have no ability to do. Um, and so my faith was about the size of a mustard seed. And what I learned in that moment was that that's all we need. While I've read that before, that is all we need because it's not really about us, it's about him. And so within that faith, if I could give him a mustard seed, he could move a mountain. I'm not going to move a mountain, but he could move a mountain. And somehow, amongst all of that, a song was written. And that's what I'm going to sing for you tonight. Once upon a time, in a far and distant land, in a galaxy that's far away, these words are often penned. But the greatest word to open the greatest story of all are the words in the beginning. They tell the story of our God. The words within pages, the characters you'll see. They are more than simple stories. These words breathe life in you and me. So let's take a look inside this book and see what we will find. It's a story that defines a love that goes beyond the test of time. So as you read the parables, stop and truth Jesus told the stories to reach the people he would meet. He showed grace and compassion, healed the people in the streets, and remember that all you need is the faith of a mustard seed. So take these words and leave them out today. Let these words take root and show the way. Let these words become a lamp unto 